Hello everyone and welcome. My name is Akmal Chowdhury. In this video we will explain what Hadoop and Big Data are. Imagine this scenario. You have one gigabyte of data that you need to process. The data are stored in a relational database in your desktop computer and this desktop computer has no problem handling this load. Then your company starts growing very quickly and that data grows to 10 gigabytes and then 100 gigabytes and you start to reach the limits of your current desktop computer. So you scale up by investing in a larger computer and you're then okay for a few more months when your data grows to 10 terabytes and then 100 terabytes and you are fast approaching the limits of that computer. Moreover, you are now asked to feed your application with unstructured data coming from sources like Facebook, Twitter, RFID readers, sensors, and so on. Your management wants to derive information from both the relational data and the unstructured data and wants this information as soon as possible. What should you do? Hadoop may be the answer. Hadoop is an open source project of the Apache Foundation. It is a framework written in Java originally developed by Doug Cutting who named it after his son's toy elephant. Hadoop uses Google's MapReduce and Google File System technologies as its foundation. It is optimized to handle massive quantities of data which could be structured, unstructured or semi-structured using commodity hardware that is relatively inexpensive computers. This massive parallel processing is done with great performance. However, it is a batch operation handling massive quantities of data so the response time is not immediate. As of Hadoop version 0.20.2, .2, updates are not possible, but appends will be possible starting in version 0.21. Hadoop replicates its data across different computers so that if one goes down, the data are processed on one of the replicated computers. Hadoop is not suitable for online transaction processing workloads where data are randomly accessed on structured data like a relational database. Hadoop is not suitable for online analytical processing or decision support system workloads where data are sequentially accessed on structured data like a relational database to generate reports that provide business intelligence. Hadoop is used for big data. It complements online transaction processing and online analytical processing. It is not a replacement for a relational database system. So what is big data? With all the devices available today to collect data such as RFID readers, microphones, cameras, sensors and so on, we are seeing an explosion in data being collected worldwide. Big data is a term used to describe large collections of data, also known as data sets, that may be unstructured and grows so large and quickly that it is difficult to manage with regular database or statistics tools. Other interesting statistics providing examples of this data explosion are there are more than 2 billion internet users in the world today and 4.6 billion mobile phones in 2011 and 7 terabytes of data are processed by Twitter every day and 10 terabytes of data are processed by Facebook every day. Interestingly, approximately 80% of these data are unstructured. With this massive quantity of data, businesses need fast, reliable, deeper data insight. Therefore, big data solutions based on Hadoop and other analytics software are becoming more and more relevant.